So the first person to send me a makeup look, he is my editor, his name is Vince. He's the one who edits my videos and, you know, creates all the magic, so shout out to him. But yeah, so he is the first person to send me a makeup look. He came out, oh my god, man, what's wrong? I haven't filmed in a while, so... Okay, so here is his picture he came out with. He came out with this very cowbell type of moment, type of vibe. I'm gonna be doing his look, so yeah. Alright guys, so I'm gonna be starting out with my MAC Painterly Paint Pot in the shade Painterly. I've been going in with this, like this is like a really good primer. I just get out my fingers and we're just gonna um, prime the lid. But anyway, I was actually talking with my brother today and can you guys believe we only have five weeks left of summer? Like literally, it did not feel like summer. I mean, yeah, it feels like summer because I literally hate the heat. Literally, if you guys know me, heat and me do not mix. Like, I don't, I don't like wearing makeup in the summer because it makes me feel nasty. And I, I, I have to take a shower like every single day. Like, I'm a very like high maintenance person, but I can't believe we have five weeks left of summer. Like, that's literally crazy. It didn't even feel like summer at all. But that's because I'm, <laughs> we know who. But we're not gonna mention her, Miss Rona. I just mentioned her, but yeah, she gotta go. <laughs> but yeah, okay, so I primed the lids. Let me see. Oh my god, can you guys see? I'm already freaking sweating. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm literally sweating already, guys. Oh no, this is not. Oh my god, I'm literally dripping. Okay. I told you, I do not know how these YouTubers wear sweaters. I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. I'm like the most sweatiest person. Okay, no. Anyway. I'm literally in Niagara Falls. Okay, anyway. Okay, so I'm gonna get started on this look. I'm gonna use the ColourPop No Filter Concealer. This is literally my favorite white concealer there is in the market. This concealer is so bomb. It's like so, it's like so full coverage. It's so like everything you need in a concealer. So I'm just gonna outline what he did. So he did like a white lid. So I'm just gonna get my, I, I usually use the applicator. So we're just gonna do the applicator. So something like that, and then we're gonna get a brush and we're gonna wing out this look. Actually, in the picture he sent me, he didn't really um, wing it out, but I'm just gonna do like my own little twist on it. We'll see how it comes out. So I'm just gonna get this little chunty brush I got at Ross or something at Walmart. I don't even remember, girl. But literally, it's my holy grail. Literally, if I don't have this brush, I cannot cut my my crease. So we're just gonna get a lot of concealer with. Too much, that's it. So I'm gonna hands like that, and we're gonna wing it out. Okay guys, so now that I winged it out, and it came out like this, I'm feeling very euphoria type of vibes. So I'm gonna take the Mag MUA Life to Dry palette, and I'm gonna take this white shade, and I'm gonna set the white. I'm gonna take this Morphe M518 brush and we're just gonna dip into the white and we're gonna set this white eyeshadow. Make sure you get a clean brush because girl you don't want other colors on this. You want this to be super, super, super white. Just tap very lightly on the concealer. You just wanna set it and say, hey girl, we're here to stay. We're here to party all night with this makeup. Lips not even though I'm staying home. But uh, we're gonna pretend we're going out. And Oops, I did some in the black. Okay, so I um, set the with the white. The shade is called Cake Face. Hot fitting. I'm not Cake Face. <laughs> I'm a natural girl. I'm not even wearing makeup. What are you talking about? So we're gonna set that, and now it's time for the little designs. As you guys can see, I am a very I love cow print. So I, I was actually really excited when my editor. He sent me this look because I love cow print. As you can tell, girl, I'll be in the summer. Like, hello. 
They'll be like, mom, 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 mom. I'll be like, girl, I got you. I'm on my way. I should have been prepared, but. Anyway, I'm gonna go, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go look for my liner. Okay, guys, so I did find my liner. This is the Wet n Wild liner. This liner is super black, super pigmented. Honestly, this is like my go to liner when I'm doing an everyday look. It's like a very like flexible tip, and we love a good tip. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, um, who's texting? Whatever. Yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna start doing the dots. As you can see, I already started a dot. And I'm actually gonna go off of my phone case. Like, help me because my hand is very shaky. So let's start the dots. <gasps> Have I had that on the whole time? Are you serious? Oh my god, you guys are gonna think I just. Never mind. Okay guys, um, I don't want to take up too much of your time, so I'm going to do the other dots on this side, and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I drew on the little cow spot, and um, I don't have the purple that he used, but I do have white, and I have like a darker purple. These are the um, Silva Beauty Hydro Liners, and the Shea Grape Soda and Space Pan- Span- Ugh. In the shade, the Space Panda, and I'm just gonna mix the two together and try and get that lavender type of vibe. So for these ones, you just wanna get some setting spray or water, whatever, and you just square, um, square. <laughs> you just square in there, okay? Just gonna wanna mix the liner like this. I don't know if you guys can see. And then I'm gonna put some on the back of my hand right here, as you can see. Very pigmented, very like bomb. Okay, so I don't want to mix the purple and the the white, so I'm gonna get a little bit of the white and mix the two. Oh, it's kind of oh girl, it's creating that lavender fantasy. Hold up, I'm gonna add some more purple, girl, and we have lavender. I'm a scientist, and we're gonna line the outside. Okay, girl, I'm just gonna outline and I'll be back. Cause you're gonna a little nervous on camera because <gasps> I'm finna mess up. I'm finna be a flop. So I'm gonna be back and do my liner. You see how this girl's gonna come out. Okay, guys, I did the purple liner. It came out super cute. Literally, um, I didn't think I was gonna pull this out, but girl, I pulled it out. Okay, so it's more purple. So I'm not gonna use the liner for um my, I can't put liner underneath my eye. I mean, you could, but why not use that? <laughs> Jeffree Star Cosmetics, uh, what is this one? Blue blood? No, um. Bloodlust. Okay, this is the Bloodlust palette. I recently got this palette. This palette, oh my god, oh, the packaging, the pigments, literally purple, so it goes with this cow purple theme. So I'm gonna take the shade Vivid Moon and don't come for me. I don't know how to say this. The Divent, Divent, whatever that shade is called. It's very pretty. It's like a very pastel purple. So we're gonna go into this palette. I'm gonna do a mixture of both of them. So give me a second, your girl. I gotta clean my makeup brushes. You all saw that? So I'm gonna take the Morphe M508 brush. It's a very little packer brush. It's a very like um, under the eye type of moment. So. Yes, I'm getting my Jeffree Star, and we're gonna take Vivid Moon with a mixture of what that shade is called, and we're gonna place it underneath the last one. Oh! Looking a little cry. Just remember, girl, blend, but don't blend in. <laughs> Okay guys, I'm gonna take this very creamy uh, white. I'm gonna put it in my uh, waterline to make my eyes really pop. Literally watch the difference. Like, look at the difference. White, no white. Oh, I'm just taking this brush, or this um, blush I got in um, my Ipsy bag. Guys, I just upgraded my Ipsy. In fact, um, it's a $25 um, one, $25 a month, I know it's a little pricey, but girl, I'm actually really excited, like, they have some good products in there, like, I'm so, oh, this blush is a little shiny. Okay, I just want to blend your contour, oh my god, this look is so cute. Okay, I'm sorry, I have like, okay, I'm doing 
doing too much. Alright guys, I'm gonna go put some blush on and I'm gonna go put some lashes. I'll be right back because I have like two other looks to do. So, okay guys, I didn't put my lashes on yet because I wanted to show you, but I did like this little type of moment. Let me blend it. It's like, because he had, on, on his he had like white line, but I wanted to do purple. I just gotta blend the two, do you see? I tried to do like an ombre effect. I don't know if I flopped, let me know in the comments. But, I just gotta blend. We're gonna leave it like that. <clears throat> but I just wanna show you guys my lashes. I got the, um, these are in the shade Insta, How, and F Boy. So I'm gonna try them out. These are actually 100% mink lashes. So I've heard so much about these lashes, so I'm really excited to try these out. Other ones on Amazon. These are like really big, dramatic type of lashes. I also got this, um, so I got like this little container. It's like a little book. The only problem is this glitter, it comes off. Literally, it looks like a freaking finger to troll. The only downside is the glitter, which is, I don't mind it, you know. Just wanted to show you guys my new lashes and the new, um, lash curtain. And shine bright like my pussy. Oh, oh it's still recording. Okay, guys, this is the completed look for the cow look. Okay, I know my foundation doesn't match my body. Don't come for me. <laughs> I know, trust me. But um, yes, this is the completed um cow look. Oh my god, these lashes. I did a little uh, weirdo, the black lipstick by Jeffree Star, the highlighter, Man in Me Way, a Greek goddess, um, the Moon Prism um, highlighter, and yes. I have the other looks to do, but I just, ha I, just have the I just had to have the cow moment, like have its own moment. But okay guys, this is the cow look. Everything's complete. But yeah, this is the cow look. Honestly, did I flop? Did I what? Let me know down in the comments what you guys think. Um, yeah. What a moment. I said moo. I said moo. I'm just kidding. Ah. Okay, let's, okay, I'm gonna throw on a little nude lipstick and then we'll be right back on. Cause this black lipstick, it's a little loud, but I think black lipstick is so pretty, but it makes my teeth look yellow, so. But anyway guys, okay, this completes the cow look. I wanted to match, you know, the shirt. Honestly, the, uh, the new lipstick makes the look way better. So, okay, I'm gonna do um, my other friend's um, look, but this completes the cow look. I don't know, let me know down in the comments below what you guys think. Let me know if I flopped, let me know if I'm horrible, let me know if I slayed and took your ombre. Oh shoot, that's been on the whole time. Ooh.